Hello and welcome to everyone. Myself Ankit. Today I am going to discuss about the first chapter of class sixth. The chapter is categories of computers and computer languages. In this video, I will discuss about categories of computers. So now let us discuss type of computers. So on the basis of their size. speed storage capacity and cost computers can be categorized into different types okay so the first type of computers is microcomputers okay so first of all i will discuss about the microcomputers so the meaning of micro is small that means the computer which are small in size and having less cost are called microcomputers right so these are usually designed for personal use therefore they are also called personal computers or pcs these are mainly used in homes schools shops etc okay and also we can categorize microcomputers according to their uses okay so we can see that there are various microcomputers that are given different names according to their uses okay so the first micro computer is desktop computers so these computers are designed to fit comfortably on the top of desks so therefore these are known as desktop computers it contains several units such as monitors cpu keyboard mouse etc and these all devices are connected to each other and work like a single unit okay the next micro computer is laptop computer so these are small in size and can be placed on the lap these are battery operated and portable and mainly used by people who travel a lot it is more expensive than desktop computers and also it having a foldable screen of 13 to 15 inch of size okay the next micro computer is tablet computers okay tablet computers so these micro computers are smaller and lighter than laptop computers but bigger than smartphones okay and it also contain touch sensitive screen for typing and navigation the meaning of navigation is means whenever you want to go up and down on the screen or we can say left or right on the screen for that purpose it has touch sensitive screen okay and uh, usually the tab tablet computers are used for reading e books watching movies surfing internet etc okay the next micro computer is palm top computers so a palm top computer is a small device that can be fit in the palm of our hand it has similar features as that of a computer it has a small screen and compressed keyboard and sometime of these com uh, these computers replace a keyboard and mouse with a pen for input purpose okay the next one is the next micro computer is handheld devices okay so handheld devices which are also called personal digital assistant or pda these are small in size devices which can be easily held in the hand okay and different types of handheld devices are the first one is smartphone the first one is smartphone so smartphone it also contain the features of personal computer and it can be used for making and receiving calls text messaging emailing web browsing video gaming and much more okay the next handheld device is game console so game console is a device which is used to play video games and it contains display screens button and speakers it can be connected to tv or computer and in this case a user can also play games through handheld controller the example of game console is sony playstation okay the next micro computer is embedded system okay so embedded system contain hardware like cpu ram rom etc with software which is embedded or we can say used in large devices 
okay so embedded system is used on tv sets vehicles cameras washing machine microwave printers and medical equipments okay embedded system does not contain any keyboard mouse screen etc so because of the embedded system these large devices works automatically that means these all devices are controlled by the embedded system embedded system are also called microcontrollers okay so let us understand the concept of embedded system by this example okay so whenever we are using microwave and we set the timings for the microwave and automatically the microwave stop as per timing set for cooking okay so all this handled by the embedded system of microwave okay so embedded system is used in large devices and that's why large devices works automatically okay so uh, these all are the example uh, these all are the types of microcomputers such as uh, desktop laptop handheld devices um, embedded system tablet computers palm top computers okay so these all are the different type of microcomputers okay the second category of computers is mini computers okay so mini computers are bigger in size than the micro computers and these computers have a higher processing speed the meaning of processing speed is uh, the the time between given input and output okay so so the time between input and output is called processing speed okay so mini computers have a higher processing speed and are more costly than micro computers okay and these computers are capable to support about 4 to 200 users at the same time okay and basically mini computers are used in banks universities and in other big organizations okay and the example of mini computers are pdp8 hp2100 microwax 3100 etc so these all are the examples of mini computers okay the next type of computers is mainframe computers so main frame main frame computers are very powerful okay and they are big in size with a large memory and high speed basically these main frame computers are designed to tackle huge amount of data okay and more than 100 users can use a main frame computers at a time okay and these computers are very expensive and are mainly used in large businesses organizations banks scientific labs airline and railway ticket reservations etc okay so that is the purpose of main frame computers okay the next category of computers is super computer okay so super computer these computers are the most powerful computers means in all categories of computers super computers are the most powerful computers with a huge processing speed these computers are used for weather forecasting space research satellite control etc okay and cray 1 cray 2 param sunway tehlite these are the examples of supercomputers okay so these all are the different categories of the computers okay once again types of computers are uh, micro computer mini computer main frame computers and supercomputers and again we can categorized micro computers in desktop computers laptop computers uh, palm top computers Uh, hand uh, means uh, um, tablet computers okay and uh, handheld devices like smartphone game consoles and embedded system okay in next video i will discuss about the computer languages okay that's all for today